workouts, and helpful advice. Add this video to your favorites. It will guide you when you train. Next exercise, jump jump plus high punch. Three, two, one, go. If you can't, do not jump. Do not curve your back during jumps. Keep your abs tight. Avoid violent impact with the floor during the descent. In order to do this, always land on your toes. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, pulse single leg sumo squat. Three, two, one, go. If you can't do it, try doing a simple squat. Be sure not to raise your heels off the floor. Don't bend or arc your back. Keep it constantly straight to avoid problems. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go. Keep your abs tight throughout the workout. Don't turn your knees inwards or outwards. Always keep them in line with your feet. Never exceed the tip of your foot with the knee to avoid damaging the joints. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, diamond push-up. Three, two, one, go. If you cannot do it, try resting your knees on the ground. Do not bend your back or lift your hips on the way down. Your head, shoulders, and hips should be aligned always. Do not strain your neck by trying to look forward. Always stare at a fixed point on the floor. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, crunch with angle touch. Three, two, one, go. If you can't, try keeping your legs bent, but place your feet firmly on the ground. Do not lift your lower back off the floor. Do not strain your neck. Staring at the ceiling may help. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, squat plus rear lunges. Three, two, one, go. If you are unable to complete this movement, bend your legs less. Don't exceed the tip of your foot with your knee during the lunges and squats. Don't touch the floor with the knee of the back leg during lunges.
Keep your abs and butt constantly tight to stabilize the spine and prevent injuries. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, sumo squat. Three, two, one, go. If you can't do it, try bending less the legs. Be sure not to raise your heels off the floor. Don't bend or arc your back. Keep it constantly straight to avoid problems. Keep your abs tight throughout the workout. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, triceps dips. Three, two, one, go. If you can't, bend your legs at 90 degrees and rest the soles of your feet on the ground. Be sure not to extend your elbows while you bring your torso down in order not to strain the joints of the arms. Keep your abs contracted throughout the entire exercise to stabilize the spine. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, low plank with raised leg. Three, two, one, go. If you cannot do it, try resting the lifted foot on the floor. Be sure not to lift your bottom. Your back and glutes should remain constantly in alignment. To be able to do this, make sure the abdominals are well contracted during this movement. Five, four, three, two, one, switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go. Be sure not to bend the neck. The head should remain constantly in line with the back. To do this, stare at a fixed point on the ground. Be careful not to flex the foot. The heel must always be directed toward the ceiling. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, high knee run plus front punch. Three, two, one, go. If you cannot do it, try doing high knee run. Do not rest your heels on the ground. Finish the descent on your toes. Do not bend or curve your back. Maintain your torso straight by staring at a fixed point in front of you while contracting your abdominals. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, side lunges. Three, two, one, go. If you can't do it, try bending less the leg. Be sure not to bend your torso sideways. Your back should always be perfectly straight. Five, four, three, two, one. 
Never exceed the tip of your foot with the knee to avoid damaging the joints. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go. Keep your abs constantly tight during the exercise to improve balance. Be sure not to bend the outstretched leg. For a better balance, try stretching your arms forward. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, dive bomber push-up. Three, two, one, go. If you cannot do it, try doing a regular push-up. Be sure not to bend your head backwards during the movement and to constantly maintain the abdominals tight. During the execution, never place the pelvis on the ground in order to maximize the effects of the exercise. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, side plank hip lift. Three, two, one, go. If you can't do it, rest your butt on the ground when you descend. Do not look at the floor. Stare at a fixed point in front of you. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go. Be sure not to lean the bust forward. The shoulders should be in line with your hips. Keep the abdomen constantly tight to stabilize the spine and avoid injuries. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Three, two, one, go. Next exercise, stretching arms, shoulders, and dorsal. Go. Do not force the upward thrust. Stop when your shoulders have reached their limit. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, deltoid stretching. Go. Don't force the movement. Stop when the shoulder has reached its maximum tension. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go. Don't rotate your torso. Have your shoulders always facing forward. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, stretching hamstrings. Go. Don't bend your legs throughout the workout to maintain its effectiveness.
Don't bend your torso. Keep it constantly straight. Five, four, three, two, one. Stop. Next exercise stretching quadriceps. Go. The knee of the back leg shouldn't touch the ground during the workout. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go. The back leg should be outstretched in order to stretch the quadriceps. Five, four, three, two, one. Stop.